Good morning, you unbelievably outstanding inhabitants of Farmington High School. Today is Friday, September 20th, and you're watching The Early Bird. I'm Carter Bunn. And I'm Josh Cartwright. Today for lunch, we will be devouring either grilled cheese or sloppy joes. Make sure to pay your $20 DECA fees to miss skates as soon as possible. Lists are now posted for your career, me career mentor groups outside the main office, on the broadcast window, and the student lounge area. If you want to change your group, you need to contact Mr. Williams today or you will not be able to. The first meeting will be next Wednesday. Seniors, it's time for you to pick your epic senior quotes. You will complete forms in your English class today, but if you're not in currently inside an English class, see Ms. Bunsgard. If you are interested in joining the photography club, see Ms. Leonard and join the Google Classroom with the cone show below. Applications are now available for the U.S. Senate Youth Programs for juniors and seniors only. You must complete an exam and an interview for the semifinals. More information can be found at the website below. The homecoming dance will be on September 28th at 8 to 10.30 p.m. in the FHS Commons. You can purchase tickets at both lunches from now through Thursday, September 28th for $10. Tickets will be available at the night of the dance for $20. Guest forms are now available for non-FHS students. Congratulations to the following people for the football recognitions. Kay Watson from Shelter Insurance this week. Colton Kilgore was the big dog of the week from last week. And this week's big dog of the week is James Payne. NHS officers have been selected. Congratulations to President Isabella Guest, Vice President Madison Erickson, Secretary Katie Jansen, and Reporter Morgan Campbell. The next meeting will take place on October 9th. Homecoming Spirit Week is next week. Monday is Dreaming of the Future Day, also known as Pajama Day. Check the posters around the school for the remaining, for the, for the remaining dress days. Remember to follow the dress code every day. As a fundraiser for Project Graduation, a Cardinal King and Cardinal Princess Princes will be selected during homecoming week. Vote for your favorite prince, one sophomore boy, and one junior boy, and your cardinal king, one senior boy. By giving your monetary donation to Miss Earnhardt, the winners will be announced at the homecoming pep rally. All boys in the class are eligible. Fields of Faith will be on October 9th from 6 to 8 p.m. at the Cardinal Stadium. Food, games, and, spe and speakers are included in the night's activities. The speakers are Ronnie Huckabee and Ron Harris. Finally, here's a quote to think about. Failure is success if we learn from it. Malcolm Forbes. Now it's finally time, time for the time you all have been waiting for. The most epic and most cool part of the broadcast, your Farmington Weekend Weather with the best meteorologist you know, Reed Petrie. Thank you, too. I'm Farmington's meteorologist, Reed Petrie, and I am pumped to share this week's weather with you. Just so you know, we are trying to use a monitor this week for the first time, so I really feel like a real meteorologist now. Today will be amazing with a high of 73, and that's all due to the decent chance of rain that we have this week that could affect tonight's game. Tomorrow will be warmer with a high of 80 and the low of 68. That'll happen with partly cloudy skies. Sunday will also have a significant chance of rain at 60% and scattered thunderstorms throughout the day. That will lead to tomorrow, which will start feeling like fall. You know why? Because fall actually technically begins on Monday. The chances of rain throughout most of next week will all make it start feeling like fall. All right, well, have a great time at the game tonight. And here's Brody Hill with Card Center to tell you all about it. Smart sound. Hi, I'm Brody Hill, and yes, this is Card Center. Not much in store this week for sports except for the Farmington football game tonight. Before I get to that, your Cardinal football team played Gravit last week. Your cards went on to win with no problems. The final score was 49 to 19. Here's a couple highlights from that game. This week, your Cardinals take on the Pea Ridge Blackhawks here at home. The Blackhawks are coming in this game with a record of 0-2, and your Cardinals are coming in this game with a record of 2-0. The Cardinals have not had great luck against the Blackhawks in the past, but that could change tonight. So, a big statement game for the Cardinals tonight, and once again, this is Card Center, and make sure to tune in to Farm Cards Live on YouTube for tonight's game. You guys, make sure to have a great Friday and a wonderful weekend. Go Cards!